credit card debt under the Fair Credit Reporting Act based upon the lender's inability to follow their own bank policy. Would you like me to provide you with more information about the program? That would be pretty sweet. I would not want you to miss out on this amazing opportunity. Mm -hmm. How can you not be interested if you haven't heard what it is that's being offered to you? I'm yeah. to help you fully understand what is being offered, and we can go from there. So, would you like to know more about the program? I beg your pardon? That would be neato. Sorry, I'm new over here. Mm -hmm. Let me transfer this call to my manager who can better assist you and answer all of your questions. Thanks. Hello. Hi. This is Chris, actually, Christopher Samson. Ooh, How Chris. Are you today? I'm good. How are you, Chris? I'm fine, thank you. Well, the reason of this phone call is in regarding that elimination. That elimination means whatever the balance you have will get eliminated under the Fair Credit Reporting Act, okay? Okay. And a law says that if a consumer who are on their fixed income, senior citizen, or the consumer who already paid more than 40% of their debt amount, in the shape of high interest and finance charges, they are no more obligated to pay back the remaining debt back to their creditors. Do you know why? Why? Because Fair Credit Reporting Act is the only mm -hmm. law which gives you a legal right to eliminate the balance that you owe. You oh. pay a long time, never be late with the payment, but it's still stuck with the balance just because of the higher rate that you're getting charged. And I'm pretty sure you know that. Okay. So at this present time, how much debt that you consider you owe on the credit cards which you are trying to pay off? Ooh, too much. An embarrassing amount. Just give me a ballpark figure. It's about $25,000. And how much time it will going to take you to pay off this debt now? Probably until I'm dead. Oh my goodness. Yeah. So the debt that you have will get eliminated under the Fair Credit Reporting Act. Okay. So the Fair Credit Reporting Act is the only law that gives you a legal right to eliminate the balance that you owe. Oh, you neat. a lot of time, never will leave with the payment, but stuck with the balance just because of the high rate that you're getting charged. Thank so you. These credit card companies, they are the one who's violating Fair Credit Reporting Act, charging mm -hmm. consumer untrue and misleading terms. Oh. In that situation, in that case, ma'am, forty percentage of the payment practices of yours goes to the principal, and sixty percentage of the payment practices of yours goes to the interest rate and hidden fee at all that you're getting charged. Mm -hmm. At this present time, which credit card accounts you consider you owe a major balance? Um. Probably my Bank of America Visa. Bank of America Visa. Yeah. And as of my very next step, ma'am, what I'm going to do, I am going to pull out the bill of your Bank of America Visa card and mm -hmm. meet you with current account summary, like the balance you owe, what was the last payment you made, monthly minimum payment up to you, and the current interest rate. And according to your billing summary, ma'am, I'm going to let you know how does that get eliminated. Okay. What is the expiration date on the Bank of America card? Just my right. hand here. I, I need to tell you something. Yes. I am 100% in love with you. Sorry? I'm in love with you. Why is that you, ma'am? Do you have a valentine? Anything else? Yeah. Valentine's Day is coming up, and I was wondering if you would be mine. Okay, tell me what is your age? Uh, I am 84. May God bless you. I have my grandfather. Thanks. Oh. Her wife is die. What about him? No, you sound better. No. I already have a girlfriend, ma'am. I do apologize. I might eliminate my debt, but I can never eliminate my love for you. Okay, just eliminate the balances that you have. What is the expiration date on the card? Um, April of 24. April of 24. And uh -huh. the number? 44. Four. Zero zero 
six, six, and then some other numbers after that. Verify with that number. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, that's what I always wanted. Chris? Chris? Ma'am, my name is David. I'm calling you from NASA Auto Care. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Fine, ma'am. Thank you. Asking the reason of my call is to let you know that the rate for auto insurance has been dropped down up to 30%. So, I do believe you drive a car, ma'am? Uh, yeah. Sometimes. Okay, ma'am, uh, which, which car are you driving right now? I'm driving a uh, 2008 Toyota Corolla. Okay. I like to drive it in which Texas. Which company are you insured? What? Which company are you insured, ma'am? Allstate. Okay, so, ma'am, what is your property in this court? What's my what? Your poverty is zip code, ma'am. What is your poverty is zip code? It's hard to understand. Um, so... Ma'am, I said what is, what is, ma'am, I said what is your poverty is zip code? Okay. Well, I need to tell you that I use the car for work. I don't know if that will affect the rate or not, but I do quite a few okay, cocaine deliveries. Okay, yeah, I usually have like 22 pounds of cocaine in the trunk because I make deliveries. Kind of like doing, you know, DoorDash or Uber Eats or something like that. Um, only instead of food, it's drugs. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, ma'am, uh, um, I'm going to connect you an agent to provide you some great health plan options. Most are very low oh. cost. So, hmm. stay on the line, okay? Oh. Once in a while, people will ask me to, like, dispose of a body for them. And then I get, like, blood in my trunk. And, like, one time, um... Ma'am, this call is regarding auto insurance, so we are providing you some oh. of cost. You're providing what? Ma'am, we are providing you some free of cost code about our insurance. This call is a cost free. If you find beneficial, then sign up. Otherwise, no cost and no obligation on it, right, right ma'am? Do you guys cover drug deliveries, though? Like, can I use my car for that? No, ma'am, we are not drug dealers. We are from U.S. Well, I know, but will my, will my car still be insured if I'm using it to deal drugs. Rude. 